Good morning. There was something from the other day. Well, a while ago, really. Um, that happened right around the time with the lions. And um, I was looking out the window. It was the other window, but... So, um, and I saw these, well, I think it was talking about the, um, disabilities thing, and I, where's this phone here, um, I was looking at the window there in the living room, and I saw these Tannenwipfe, I don't even know, um, well, the tip of trees like Christmas trees. <laughs> um, but I saw these like swaying in the wind and there was something in it. I felt it, felt such a deep beauty. Uh, it reminded me of Heidi, who probably you, you'll know, but if you don't know, she's this, it's like a... I think it was a book first, probably, but it's this TV series, and they made cartoon version, they made a, like, real-life version, at least, um, back in the olden days, I don't know if there's a newer one, but I bet there might well be, because it's very well-known, and she's, you probably know this, but anyway, she's the, this little girl who lives with her grandpa in the mountains, and he took her in. After I think her auntie or somebody couldn't look after her anymore. I was so sad about that, that as a kid. But I don't know what it was trying to tell me. But I felt it so strongly. Ooh, look at that. Bird. It won't zoom. How? Oh, it's already zoomed in so much. Okay. Um, even looking at the houses now, it's almost like if that was like the roof of... Oh, sorry. I can't even... Where the windows are now, like, that little tip looks like a roof of, like, a hut in the mountains, but... I don't know what it's trying to tell me, though. Oh, I think there was... It, is it related to, um... Because I was learning about the disabilities, but... There's this other girl... Is it Clara or something? And she didn't... Which always sounded, like, clear, but... Because Kla means clear in German. I don't know what it's trying to tell me. But she also was in a wheelchair for a while. I think I think she was in a wheelchair, wasn't she? And then they tried to like <coughs> give her hope to walk again eventually. But this is like, maybe it was just related to that. I don't know what it was trying to tell me. But I feel, I felt strongly that it was trying to tell me something. So I wanted to relate as much to you as I've gathered from it, so that at least, like, you'll know that. And if you ever come around to it, then, you know, then that might be something, might have been something to it. Maybe it already was that, and I did get to speak about disabilities, but, like, I don't really know. Why, why the mountains, why these, but the trees, the way they were swaying and things. Like exactly, they had the hut in the mountains there, so. Show the houses a little bit. Um, right. Yeah, I don't know what else to say, say really, because I didn't really, really grasp, or I didn't really capture what that really was trying to tell me. I just know there was something in it that was just. There was like such a beauty in it. Um, there was like such a beauty in it. I was looking. It was like, and they look so distinguished now. In front of the sky, probably even more so in real life. Without the glass screen in between as well, with a window, because sometimes. That makes things less clear, and uh, I think that'll be it for this. Oh, sorry, I was just filming this guy. Um, I felt it. It's like so hard to describe to you because I felt it. It's like Heidi. It looks like Heidi, 
but like I don't know any more to it so I wanted to put this out so far that at least like yeah at least you guys will know and um if there's anything more to be discovered out of it then I can add to it later but maybe it has already gotten sad and simply haven't realized it through this but sometimes you realize things later so no promise I don't know if it was important in that sense that well it felt important but if there's if I maybe already captured it through another way I don't know but yeah this was all I wanted to share with you should I actually open the open the window see it a bit more clearly um, but they were also very like connected with nature because they lived in the mountains and there were goats and things so that Peter guy was looking at was the the shepherd the lonely goat herd maybe not but he was he's a shepherd he looked after the goats that's not very natural sounding here trains in the background but, um yeah I, I don't really know what else to say because that's really all I, I i gathered at the time but um i hope you liked it anyway um at least you'll have seen it so there was something to it you know you might when you come around to it notice it and yeah but it felt so nice also like to be I mean they would have been very connected more connected than us to nature because and the, the grandpa looked like a recluse but at the end of the day they struck up a real good bond and a real close loving relationship because I think her mom died and the aunt seems so cruel at the time and when I was a kid it was, it was always like she didn't want to bother to take care of her but maybe that was just my interpretation but um yeah as this window closes so is the video about to do so I hope you liked it um I hope it will have been useful information for you usable information at the end of the day once you need it if you do but you know I simply wanted to tell this because I didn't have anything more on that yet, but maybe what, what needed to get through has already gotten through. I don't know. Um, yeah, you can see my reflection filming, and I will see you in the next one. We'll see you very soon. Take care of yourselves, and thanks for all the love, and I um, hope you like this video. If you feel like it, you can comment, etc., and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Goodbye.